What's going on everybody? It's been here from the Elite Gaming Series playing a free-for-all match and I thought I would kind of give you a uh, sort of inside the mind type of commentary today. I'm basically going to try and um, tell you what I'm thinking as I'm playing this game live uh, as fast as I can while still playing the game. So, I mean, we'll see how it works. Since I just killed that guy, I'd like to stick towards the sides in free-for-all because I know a lot of the choke points are normally somewhat around the middle of the map. So I want to stick around the sides while still uh, aiming my sights to just pop around the corners real quick. I'm trying to remember what perk it is that, um... Ooh, wow, that was a shotgun. I'm trying to remember what perk it is that, um, lets you... It's basically stalker, but for this game. And honestly, that would come in such great, uh, use if I was using that during this commentary right now. Uh, the way I'm playing, because if you're like to take it slow around corners, you're going to need that perk, whatever it may be. I'm pretty sure it's in this game. Anyways, I just saw the guy up there, so I'm going to assume... I'd like to assume he's still up there the entire time. So i got to be careful going around that corner. And I'll caution that whole sort of spiel. Oh, and what I tell you, still up there. So, now I got the advantage. What I want to do is I want to try and get a little height on my opponents and uh, kind of keep them at bay and away from here. I have no claymore, so I have to watch it so that kind of stuff happens. But at the same time, capitalize off where I'm at. And realize that, whoop, realize that uh, I'm in a pretty good spot right now. As much as I don't like it when other people are in the spot, you have every reason to like it when you are. Because look at that, I just got three to kill the idiots trying to get up here while I'm watching it. Whoop, Hostile and UAV that's above. what happens. Probably should have just kept watching that spot, actually. Anyways, uh, back on topic. I just saw this guy run around the corner. I saw him drop and took him out pretty easily. Okay, again, stick to the outside a little bit. Hostile Almost drop shot him, but nope, didn't quite get me. Got me before he was on. Before he uh, finished. And ooh, almost had him. Probably should use my tomahawk there just for the really quick kill. Anyways, let's travel up here. Okay, no one's on this. So it looks like I'm relatively safe right now, but you never, you can't ever assume that. I'll look, turn around here and someone's climbing up or pretty close, like that guy right there. Uh, see if I can hop in here, just get behind a wall into cover. I've seen red dots over there, so that's where I want to go. I run towards danger, I don't usually run away from it unless I know I'm not going to win the gunfight. Uh, in that case, it was just bad, but, uh, whoop, almost, where'd he go? Ah, uh, he almost got me, almost got me, but I drop shot him. He was waiting for me to get around that corner, but it didn't work. Now, that guy with the shotgun keeps getting me this game. I gotta figure out how to keep away from that. Just kind of stay away from these, um, doorways as about? much as possible, or at least check around them. Just keep around, uh, keep around here a little bit. So, I see anyone? I just saw someone drop out of there. He went that way, his so he's probably heading towards me. What I tell you, normally someone, normally what happens in the gunfight, especially in free-for-all where this is useful, or multi-team now, um, you gotta realize the enemy of your enemy is your friend. Use him whenever you can, basically. You have to, um, have to know where he's going. And if you see two people in the gunfight and one guy goes down, Chances are the other guy isn't altering his path, so whichever way he shot towards to kill the other guy is probably where he's going. It's a little quick to throw you. Uh, usually gets me kills because you gotta anticipate where the other person is all the time in Call of Duty. If you want to keep a uh, keep a good streak going, things like that, you gotta know what's going on. You gotta be looking at your map now and then. You gotta be checking your ammo, make sure you're not running out, anything like that. Reload. Blah, 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 blah. You basically want to be on top of as much as you can in this game. Especially in these multi-team or free-for-all type of game modes. Anyways, I'm still not quite sure where everybody is. I want to go across the map to go see where that red dot was and kind of investigate. But on second thought, I'm going to stick, kill back a little bit, wait for the spawns to uh, flip around a little bit. Kill that guy while he's still here. And, ooh, come on, come on, come on. And uh, I don't want to rush out because if you're rushing... Usually what's going to happen is you're just not in a uh, not in a completely safe area if you're just rushing to go for a red dot. Nope. Almost, almost, almost. And I kind I like to play it safe, especially when you're trying to get kill streaks or win a game or things like that. Uh, if you're playing with mates and you're just trying to uh, trying to basically uh, play as a team and not so much as a individual, yeah, go right ahead, uh, talk to teammates, do any of that kind of thing. But 
uh, while you're doing this, and damn, there's still that shotgun. Care package while you're doing this, so you really have to um, kind of keep it easy. Now I'm not gonna watch that uh, that area Only over there just for the sheer UAV fear incoming. that someone's gonna pop up in that Death window and wreck me. By. So I've defended that enough. Death machine, you want some? Uh, never a bad thing. I'm gonna see if I can get up to one of those high points and uh, take a little. Death machine spinning up. So, well, Death there's a the guy coming up right now. I oh, actually died. He got me. Nice thing about the death machine in this game, though, is that you, it does not disappear. Death machine per se. on standby. But it does take time to wind up, so maybe next time I go over there, I'll keep my gun out for a little bit. I can't flash it because I don't have flashes yet. Which is surprising you you unlock pretty late in this game. It's like in the 30s, I think, maybe early 40s. Don't really remember. Anyways, uh, back on topic. Hostile I gotta UAV find a above. decent place to uh, use this thing. I'm I'm probably not gonna be able to mount it anywhere for. The fact that everybody's already in the spots I want to get to. So I'm just going to kind of run around the series, choke points. Someone's up there. Death Damn it, I really shouldn't have backed down while he was looking out that window. And now I'm tied up. I'm, see, I'm losing my loot because I'm trying above. to waste time using this death machine, which I think is pretty cool. Normally, uh, use your gun, use your instinct. You have it for a reason. And uh, you should be fine in this game. What I like death machines for is, um, more Death or less uh, team game deployment. modes like domination or demolition where everybody gathers around a a particular area and then you just mow them all down. But other than that, I just like to keep my sights on one person with a gun. Death because machine love like that, the Death Machine has to wind up. And I know I'm trying to kill myself showing you this. Hostile so I'm not doing it anymore. I'm not even going to use Death Machine anymore. Death machine because it's a pretty by. cool thing to have when you get it. But it's you got to rem remember uh, to separate when it's cool to have it and when it's useful to have it. I know the death machine is on standby. Stop telling me. Okay, I'm in the middle here. I should probably get out of here. Walk into the club. Check both doorways over here. Saw the guy run over there. I didn't check that other doorway though, which I probably should have. Uh, I'm gonna wait for him where I got a clear shot at him. That was not a clear shot. This is a clear shot. Right out in the open, leaving him uh, leaving him ready to get shot at. Saw the guy run this one, get chased after him. It's nice because he has the edges. He flashed someone over here, which either means he was just checking or someone's over here, so I want to approach this with Death caution. Ready for and the shotgun guy's going to get you just Be advised. like that. Hostile and yep, that shotgun inbound. guy's in first place right now. That's why I got to um, got to be careful about that. So, whoop. Just saw that guy. Just saw him. Death machine ready for deployment. Alright, looks like a Hellfire Swarm is uh coming in right now. Didn't kill anyone, though, which is, I guess, pretty good. Uh, I'm going to kind of pick around this corner a little bit, walk in here. I'm probably going to go left because I just saw the red dot over there. Go around here carefully, around this one too. Be advised, I'm going to go up this way. Death machine ready for Ooh. deployment. Did not check that corner. Checking your corner is just too important in this game. You really have to, um, I, you really have to, like I said, just know where the enemy is. Death machine Ooh, on standby. Is killing me. It's horrible because I'm a running gun above. class, so it's not really the best, um, the best, uh, thing I can be going against right now. I died over here by the shotgun guy, so I'm going to approach it with caution. Kind of keep my sights aimed around the corners. Uh, whoop. Death machine ready for Damn, deployment. I was too busy trying to think the shotgun guy was in there that I just turned around and, uh, ate bullets, quite honestly. So I'm five kills away from first place. I don't think it's going to happen before this other kid with the shotgun gets one. But you know what? Yeah, never give up until the game's over. Not really too much more to say about that. Pretty self-explanatory. Uh, that kid did not get his kill. Oh, that might be... That's a shotgun guy, I think. Alright. So you got to whip out your pistol right there. Like I said, I'm always running with a pistol after those past, uh, past games. So, oh my god, the shotgun, dude. Alright, well, I won 27-27. Nope, no. I won 27-24. I take that back. Uh, decent game. I thought I told you guys a lot. Sorry if I kind of just mumbled on a little bit. If you guys like the gameplay, please like, favorite, consider subscribing. I post every day. Comment. I listen to your suggestions. Tell me what you want to see on my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next